I wasn't expecting this much emotion. <laughs> Hello, Jeremy, this is Sada. I detect that Coridon has regained more of its original power. While riding upon it, it seems you should now be able to move across water. Coridon can now move across bodies of water, opening up new ways to get around. If you press the B button while you're on the water, Coridon can even jump. I am relying on you to continue taking good care of Coridon. Well, there we go. That's another Titan Pokemon down then. And a whole lot of lore. Now, what do I want to do? I could go so many places now. I could even jump into the water. Now I can just fight Pokemon in the water as well now. More Pokemon than ever before. Basculin. Let me make a drain. I don't think that's going to kill it. Unless it does. Actually, yeah, that's super effective. I thought it was the other way around. Never mind. I'm crazy. It's fine. I can find as many fish Pokemon as I want now. Uh, let's throw a net ball. I think dive ball should be effective against this as well. Because Dive Ball is more effective when catching Pokemon on or in water. Please catch, please catch, please catch, please catch, please catch. I don't know how to catch this any other way, so... Nope, okay. Also, those... Are those Psyduck under the water? I think they are. It's kind of cool. Gonna throw another Dive Ball. Really? You're making this so difficult for me. How do I want to- I don't know. I have a lot of extra balls, so I'm going to start using them, I think. Just so I'm not holding on to these extra different types of balls. Other than just the regular ones. Like Pokeball, uh, Great Ball, and Ultra Ball. You are really making this difficult for me. Maybe I should switch Pokemon or something, I don't know. Let's go... Whiskash. Maybe. Since it's not very effective to use water against this, apparently. Should be good. Just to chip down its health a little bit, maybe. Except we're way higher level than it. Water Pulse. Please don't kill it. Thank you. And I confuse it. Please don't kill. Please. Oh dear. It's fine. Confused. Used by. It. Okay, that's good. We're fine. Netball again. Yep, those are side up under the water. How did you not catch? Basculin is confused. Hurt itself. It's very close to... It's very close to fainting. Please catch! Why? You didn't even... You didn't even... Also, you're gonna... Please... Okay, it used flail. Oh, that was close. Please, netball. This is more effective. Why? Why... Why is this so difficult? I don't understand. You know what I should do now? Use a timer ball. Since we're like turn 15 or something, I don't know. Three. Cool. There we go. It's a cool ball. Red striped form. Interesting. I'm not going to know the difference. Other than that, I'm just gonna throw up my Pokemon to do some stuff for me. I don't think there's any more here to get, so I still can't climb. Good. Please. I can't even jump. This is sad. 
Let me go around and see if I can get up that way. There we go. Air cutter. Man, it's so nice being able to access water now like this. There's so many places where it's been a problem, but now we can actually probably even cross rivers or some stuff like that. Which is going to be super helpful. Well, what do I, where do I want to go? Where do I want to go now? Is another question that I have. I think we've mostly cleared this mountain area, so... I should probably go back and get that stake that I didn't do because I couldn't jump to it. See if I will be successful a second time. It's nice that I put that marker on the map. Also, do I have one of you? I forget. Yes, I do. Cool. Goodbye. Get him! So where is the thing? All the way back here. I'm gonna also grab this item here. And the gimmick ghoul that's on this sign. I saw it. I love how I don't even read the signs, I just care about the gimmick ghoul on the sign. Also there's a bridge. Bridge? Br bridge. Bridge. <laughs> bridge? There's no gimmick ghoul here. Got an Everstone, though, which will prevent Pokemon from evolving if they uh, are holding that. Enjoy picnicking? Nothing goes with a sandwich, like a nice few, haha. -ha. Glad to have run into you, kiddo. Here's a gift. Make sure you, you sa make sure to savor the taste of adventure. Eating a sandwich and getting pumped with meal powers makes journeying all the better, haha. -ha. Care to rest those traveling feet and, and stop for a while since you're here? Sure. It'll probably be a good good plan. I'm also going to bring up Twitter very quickly so I can check a thing because I know about something. Working hard is key, but so is getting off your feet now and then. Besides, you can't enjoy the scenery when you're always on the move. Haha. <laughs> okay. I need to figure out how to do this. I think it's probably going to be in the Poke Portal. But if I go to my profile, hang on. Uh, mystery gift. With code password. I guess I want to connect to the internet. Okay, this is this is a long code. But we get this because of the... The Cerebi update. Or something. I'm not sure how... if this is gonna stay around. Uh, this is not the... This is not the thing. That... oh no, it's fine. It is. Has to be capitalized. Okay, so... H... A... J... One. M. E. Zero. R. One. G. One. N. A. L? Is that it? I think so. Verifying. Searching for gifts. Sandwich ingredients gifts. Nice. Got that code from Twitter. Oh, cool. <laughs> I wasn't sure if that was going to work, but it worked, so that's good. Ten peanut butter, ten. Pr pr I don't even know. Hamburger, ten, ten, ten of all the things. Ten cream cheese, ten noodles, ten rice. Cool. Look at that date. <laughs> it's fine. Check mystery gifts. I think that's just the thing. Okay. Just gonna. Oh, I kind of want to check the news. 
I don't think it's going to be anything else. Let me just disconnect. But there we go. Let's go back. And keep exploring, I guess. I saw this staircase up before, and I want to know what this is all about. So I'm going to walk up very carefully and not fall off. And get slightly sick. I can hear a Gimme Ghoul. I'm not going to get hit by the pr 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 propeller. Where is Gimme Ghoul? I heard it. But I don't see it. I hear it more now. How am I supposed to get up there? He nope, that's not gonna work. Ah, falling. How are you supposed to get that? There's no way, as far as I'm aware. So how? Yeah, falling. Okay, well I'm not gonna get that then. Cool. If that's the way it must be, that is the way it must be. Oh, hello. I was just trying to jump, and it didn't work. Hang on, give me a second. Okay, where is it? I'm gonna jump from as high up as possible. Yeah. Is that a gimmick ghoul over here? There's a gimmick ghoul over here. <sighs> of course there is. But there's a yellow stake, which is not connected to the, the purple ones. So let's pull that out. So we're going to have to find another mysterious door. We're also going to have to find three more of those yellow stakes, so... Have to keep our eyes open. Now, what else, would I, what, what else do I want to do? I don't know. I can go anywhere now, basically. Kind of. Not really. I can go across water is the thing, and it feels like that's a very good thing to have the ability for. I still don't know what I want to do exactly. I guess I should probably check the map to see what else I can do at the moment. This seems like a large area to explore. I don't want to explore it too much right now, but I will explore a little bit. It's nice just running through and not worrying about too much. Haven't seen any new Pokemon around here. Guess I should also be fighting some of the trailer tra tra trainers. Along the path that we were just passing by before. Hey, I started out from the west gate of Mesa Goza. Crazy. I think I also did. Marin the student. Sent out Pikachu. Anything effective? Guess I'll Mega Drain. I'm over leveled, so this should be good. Simple enough. I'm paralyzed. Great. Absorb. Couldn't move because it's paralyzed. I mean, while the, the manky are just dancing or something. Absorb. There we go. That's better. Fainted. Mysterious. I'm going to switch to, I think, uh, Skeledurge. Because I think I can use Bite. It's super effective. There we go. Did you start from out from the West Gate too? I did. Thank you for noticing. I don't know how you noticed, but I, I guess you did. I'm gonna send out my starter Pokemon from this point for a bit. Ice heal, nice. We can actually heal that. If we ever get frozen. Dragon Tail TM. Is this for you? Also, hello, cave. 
Are you the one who ordered pizza to be delivered out here? Oh no. That's a shame for you. Ahmed the courier. Sent out Wingull. That's a shame for me. It's fine. We're overleveled. We'll be fine. Everything's fine. Let's use Bite. Nice. Just a passerby, huh? Yep. Thank you for the money, though. How much are they tipping you? Also, what is this madness of an area? I don't know. I'm gonna try in the cave to see what's in here. Some Pokemon we've seen before. Also, a Dusk Ball. Better at catching Pokemon at night or in dark places. Also, there's a yellow stake here. That's lucky. This, probably, this is probably one that takes a while to find, maybe. Except I found it just wandering around. But it's underground, so it's difficult to tell where it is, I guess, so. Just want this potion times three. It's like a potion, but three times <laughs> three times better. Also, whoa, hello. Nest ball. I can't get up there, I don't think. Unless I be clever. Or not. This seems like a weird cave. I might just have to go around. Unfortunately. Also, hello. Sableye. Say, 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 yeah, is that right? Yes. Um. Uh, nest ball. Or else. One, two, nope. Almost had it. Used fake out. Doesn't affect me. Cool. We're in caves. That's also good. Try a dusk ball. I don't want, don't know what type this is, so I don't even think I can lower its health at all. Again, I want to throw mud. Maybe we should throw, uh, Ultra Ball, just to have the extra luck. Maybe. One, two, three, caught, nice. I was level 38, wow. Dark Ghost, again, very cool. There's so many good, <laughs> there's so many good Pokemon combinations of types. You know what I mean. There's so many. I grab that. I'm also gonna make sure I don't see anything off the edge. There's two, there's two things. One of them is a TM. It's fine. Mud shot and a revive. Okay. I shouldn't be worrying this much about going off the edge because I can, I can run fairly quickly. So. Also, a hyper potion. Well worth going off the edge, I guess. See if we can get to the other side of this cave then. Okay, where are we? Area 4. There's quite a lot of Pokemon around. Pretty sure I've got one of those already. Also, oh, hello. Something. A Toxel. I'm gonna snarl at it and hopefully not kill it. Never mind, I killed it. Toxel painted. Well, that's a shame. Oh well. I think there's another one right here. I'm gonna just Ultra Ball again. One, two, three, caught. Nice. Ultra Ball's going really well for me. Worth worth having them. Electric poison. Interesting. Hang on, don't I have? No, you're electric fighting, aren't you? I've already got a, 
about an alright electric type, so. But if if poor me or Pomo had only one type, then maybe I'd do that. But no, we're good. We're good. For now, sir. Ten Pomic Berry. Excuse me. Let's go. Let's get it, get down to it. Please forgive my being barefoot. Okay, I forgive you. But I'm still gonna beat you up. Amando the Black Belt. Sent out Krogunk. Guess I just go with my stab move because I'm just in a um trainer battle. I'm not trying to catch anything. Just trying to win, you know. Perhaps I have had a chance if I had been wearing boots. Yeah, I wouldn't want to be out here just barefoot. Now for the ultimate final boss of dealing. Gonna run away safely. Get him. I like saying that for some reason. Ah, items. Have to pick up all the items even though I don't really need them. This is a very cool area. It's another Gumi. Forgot one of those. I really want to find a Ditto at some point. Also, hello. Hello. Scyther. I'm gonna round you. I think this is probably gonna just take it out. Nope, we're good. Fury Cutter. It's not very effective. Might try a regular Pokeball. Let me guess. No, I have no idea. Double team. That's not going to save you from my Pokeball. Although I think I should actually use a Great Ball. Just make sure that this will work. No. Maybe Ultra Ball? One, two, three, caught. Nice. Scythe was caught. Bug flying? No. Yes. Maybe. Bug flying. Called it. Just, to, just ignore the fact that I had no idea. Misty terrain. TM. Speak of misty terrain. It's raining. Also, we're here. We're, we're, we're here. And this is this is not where I thought we were. Oh, it's especially not where I thought I was because this is this is here. Okay. Interesting. I had no idea where I was. That explains why the Pokemon were a lot less level than I would have expected. Because we're basically next to the first gym that we did. So that's something, I guess. Just gonna clear out this area of items so I don't have to explore it anymore. Unless we need more Pokemon, that is, I guess, so. Which I will probably do eventually. Getting all the Pokemons. This is a very cool area of terrain here with this little ledge going all around, all around the edge of the mountain. I approve. It's very windy. I'm not sure if that's just because I'm running there. Some drift loom. Spikes TM. Just gonna bite you. I think I do get more XP from actually fighting the fight manually, so it's probably worth doing. Also, you sound a lot like, um,. Valu from Wind Waker. Grab all these things. Train my Pokemon up, Pokemon up. Although I'd probably need to fight these ones since they're not that high leveled. It's still useful to have the XP though. 
Oh, so we can do stuff like this now, where we can just drop into the river and go across. Ah, such a nice thing. Now, what's effective against fighting again? I really should memorize these things. <laughs> it's crazy how that happens. Oh, so this is this area. Oh, wow. I remember being here. Okay, um... God of War, maybe? I don't know if, it, if Psychic will work, but I'm going to try. Actually, hang on. If I do this... It's not going to tell me what's effective, is it? No. Nope. No, it's not. That's a shame. I was really hoping that it would. But I like doing that. Because you're trying to switch Pokemon, but nope. Okay. Anyway, let's challenge this thing. We don't need to catch it, though, so we're good. I just want the XP candies. So I can level up my, my, level up my Pokemon even more. It's got to take a while to actually level them up to whatever level I probably need them to be. Okay. Yeah, I was right about these. Fairy and Psychic are both effective, so that's, that's very good. I'll keep that in mind. I might have known that already, but just didn't realize it. Which is why I was doing it. So it'll be good to really know. For sure. Nice. Don't catch, don't catch. Also, you can't just press B to not catch. You have to actually go down and press A. But there we go. All the rewards. What do I, what, what, do I want to go across the river again and check that area there? I kind of want to check that area, but I'm not sure if I'm going to do it right now. It has been a while since we were last here. I could also go down here and explore a little bit more. I don't know what I, I don't know what I'm doing. Leopard berry restores power points. Apparently, there are so many trainers that you'll probably miss in this game. I hope you're getting enough to eat. Thank you. I hope I'm getting enough to eat as well. Angeline's the cook. Send out Combi. It's not super effective, but it is effective. I think you have two Pokemon. Based on the split second I saw. <laughs> did you just spin? Did, 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 did that just happen? Did they just spin? I really hope so. Because that's amazing. Yeah, it is just two Pokemon. Nice. <laughs> Spin. Good, you seem well. Well, that's good to know. It's a good thing you give me a thousand poker dollars when I defeat you. Makes it worthwhile. Now, what do I want to actually go to next? Because... Hang on. No, this is fine. Maybe. Zoom out. So these are all the ones we've done. It actually shows us the order that we've done them in. That's actually interesting. But there's this one here. And that one there. And that one there. Also that one there. There's a lot here. But then there's also that one there, that one there. I guess that one there and that one there. That one there. So either side is, seems pretty good right now. It might make sense to go do that one because that was the last one at the bottom of the map. And that one's for... Something. <laughs> I don't know. I think that's Victory Road because it's got the red ring around it. There's this Team Starbase there. There, there, and there. 
There's actually another Titan Pokemon right there, and the one over there, which is actually very close to the Lighthouse. I probably want to do that next, so... Let's zoom in, slowly. Nope, that's not where it... I don't like that, how it does that, but it's fine. So it looks like we just need to go up and around to get to there. To do that one next, so... Well, let's do that, but also I think that's probably it for now. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.